Recently, I've been banging on about just how dry the South Downs in Southern England are at the moment, but no longer. So it's time to ditch this carbon hardtail and start riding this bad boy. This is a 2012 Genesis IOID. At first glance, it looks a bit like a single speed, but in fact, it has hub gears. The reason this bike is particularly well suited to UK winter riding is because the hub gears are housed in a sealed unit, so this should be maintenance free. However, that is not quite true, and as I did find out, the hub gears do have to be periodically serviced. So let's talk about how this bike performs on descents, when climbing, and on single track. On the downhills, the bike doesn't feel as smooth as my 29er, and the fork, while being adequate, isn't what I would exactly call plush, so the overall feel is a bit more bumpy than I would like. The bike climbs pretty well but is only limited to 8 gears so if it gets really steep you'll probably find yourself searching for that extra low gear that just isn't there. While on the single track the bike performs really well, it's nippy, responsive, manoeuvrable. I think having the 26 inch wheels is a real plus point here. Let's now talk about some of the bike's specs. The bike has got RockShot Recon Gold forks with 100mm of travel. And it's got race face cranks. And it's got Shimano hydraulic disc brakes. And here's the money shot. That's the Alfine 8 speed hub beating hard the bike. Right, let's summarise then. The hub gears are great, really suited to a UK winter as they are in a sealed protected unit. Once you get used to changing gear on a hub bike, you will find the gear changes are really smooth and the whole gearing unit is super quiet. On the downside, the bike is not maintenance free as I found out to my cost. It is also a little on the heavy side which is probably a reflection of the cost of the bike and I would advise if you're going to be doing long rides on this machine I would definitely invest in a new saddle. If you'd like to ride something a bit different other than the dominant brands you see out there then this bike ticks a lot of the boxes. With its steel frame, hub gears and 26 inch wheels this is one of the more quirky bikes you'll see out on the trails. But for me, it does exactly what I want it to do. Keeps changing gears in a smooth and quiet fashion, whatever the weather. So I would love to hear from the lovers and haters of hub gear bikes in the comments below. And I'll see you on the next video.